you're going to be creating the beaded earring. You're going to be given two pieces of copper wire that are each five inches long. You are going to have two earring wires and you're going to have beads to choose from. You should pick out a set of beads. You're going to need two larger beads and two that are a little smaller. You also are going to need to find two very small beads that will be your starter beads. It's very hard to see them. Two little beads. To start your earring, you're going to take the wire, the five inch one piece of wire, and you're going to thread through the little starter bead. And you're going to put that right in the middle of the wire and then you are going to bring the two ends up so that they're even. And then you're going to twist that little starter bead, the wire around the little starter bead about four times so it's nice and tight. And then you are going to put those two pieces of wire together so that you have a beginning of your earring that looks like this hard to see with this camera. Okay, that's what it's going to look like to start with. Then you can start putting your beads on. If you uh, want to have something that looks a little bit, um, you know, with, with the proper proportion, you're going to put the larger bead on the bottom, you're going to put the smaller bead on the top, and that'll make an attractive little bead. It's very simple to do. So I'm going to take my larger bead and put it on and I can at this point put the other bead on and I could be finished or what I might want to do is take another bead in the center of this so it has a little bit more um, design. Okay so we have the first bead and I have a little glass bead uh, that I'm going to add next. Then I'm going to take my little bit smaller bead and put that on. And I could add maybe one more bead or I could be finished at this point. So what I'm going to do is I am going to be finished. I'm going to add my earring wire and you can leave just a teeny bit of space so that it, that it hangs, okay, and it gives you a little room to wrap this wire around. You just want to take the wire and wrap it around nice and tight so you can't wrap it anymore. You have a little bit left over, okay? And I'm just going to take a scissor and I'm going to cut this. This is copper lamp wire that you can get at Home Depot. It's very inexpensive. It's like 16 cents a foot, and there's seven strands of it. So it's nice to make jewelry because you don't need any special jewelry making tools. It bends really easily, and it cuts with a scissor, and it looks nice, and it's really copper. So it makes a nice little earring. So there's your finished earring. And then you're going to repeat the process for the other one, and very nice. Okay, the last thing you're going to do is put your earrings, your finished earrings, on a card. We're going to give you pieces of card like this, and you are going to put a little slit with a scissor in the card, and you're going to put the earring on the card. And you're going to turn it around on the back, and you're going to put a piece of tape on it, and then you are going to wrap it in a piece of tissue and you'll be done.